Hi everyone, I'm Skye and welcome to this advanced tutorial on creating powerful AI prompts using Picklemon. Today, I'm going to show you how to craft detailed prompts that really help Picklemon generate stunning images. I'll also walk you through exactly where and how to enter these prompts so you can follow along easily. Section 1, Where to Enter Prompts. All right, once you open Picklemon, you'll see the prompt input box right here at the top of the screen. This is where you type your descriptions, basically telling the AI what you want it to create. For example, let me type in a simple prompt first, a cat in a forest. Then I click generate and watch the magic happen. But today we're going beyond basics. Section two, using an advanced prompt. So now I'm going to enter a more advanced prompt to show you the difference. I'll paste this into the prompt box. A sprawling neon lit cyberpunk cityscape at night, rain soaked streets reflecting vibrant pink and blue lights, flying cars zooming past towering skyscrapers, cinematic wide angle view in the style of Sid Mead and Blade Runner, ultra detailed high contrast. Once I hit generate, Picklemon will create a much more dynamic and detailed image. Section three, how to structure your prompt. When you're typing your prompt into that input box, try to follow this structure. Start with your main subject and scene. Add descriptive details like lighting and mood. Include any actions or movement you want to see. Mention camera angles or perspective. Reference art styles or artists to guide the style. Add quality descriptors like ultra detailed or photorealistic. This helps the AI understand exactly what you want. Section four, using negative prompts. Picklemon also lets you add negative prompts, phrases telling it what to avoid. In the interface, you'll find a box labeled negative prompt right below the main prompt box. For example, if I want a clean image with no text or blur, I'll type no text, no watermark, no blur in that negative prompt box. Section five, combining concepts. Want to mix ideas? Just enter them together in the prompt box. For instance, here's a cool one I'm going to try now. A medieval knight exploring a futuristic space station, dramatic lighting, high detail, cinematic, hit generate and see how Picklemon blends those worlds. Remember to use commas to separate different ideas when you type your prompt into the box. And if Picklemon supports weights, repeat important keywords to emphasize them. Save your favorite prompts so you can tweak and improve them over time. That's it. Now you know exactly where to enter your prompts in Picklemon and how to write advanced ones that make your images really stand out. If you liked this tutorial, please like and subscribe. I'm Sky. Thanks for watching and happy creating. <laughs>